Now turning to our top local story today, the murder trial is now underway for a local man accused of brutally killing his common law wife a year ago and then dismembering her body. It is our top local story this new time and Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly has been at the courthouse all morning long. He joins us now live with the latest with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Sean? Danielle, a murder trial is now underway here at Superior Court in Providence. You should know that this case involves accusations that are so unconscionable, they're hard to get your mind around. Any police charges? Not guilty on all counts. It was in January of 2012. The Johnston police said 53-year-old Donald Greenslid confessed to killing his common-law wife, 39-year-old Stacy Durego. They say he admitted he stabbed her in the chest and then cut up her body and wrapped it in cloth and tried to burn it in the fireplace. He claims that it was self-defense, that she tried to, uh, she tried to uh, attack him with a knife. Uh, he fended her off, and in, in the process of fending her off, he uh, stabbed her. Two young children, a three-year-old girl and a five-year-old boy, were inside the house. They were taken to the hospital and treated for smoke inhalation. I've seen her leave the house kind of beat up a few times. A neighbor who lives across the street is especially worried about the five-year-old boy. I've heard that the little boy knows, you know, what, uh, knows a little bit of what happened to his mother. Um, I know he's seeing counseling. Um, I just, I just hope he turns out all right. During his opening statement this morning, a prosecutor said that at the time, Donald Greenslit tried to kick firefighters who responded to the fire out of his house. Quote, get out of my house. I've got it under control. I'm burning wood. I have no oil. Live at Superior Court with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.